Carrots, 445 degree oven today. You want them all about the same thickness and flat side down into the oven. I got green beans here that were getting close, that are frozen because they were getting close to their expiration date. But I just put the whole bag in the freezer, no worries. These have been in here long enough for me to saute the onion. I mean, oh, cut the onion up. I'm going to stick the onion in the middle. April said, I, got will I get willy-nilly with the salt. So, I got curious. This is about the same size as the saucepan. And we're going to see, we're going to measure about how much salt I put in each time, each time I salt something in this pan. Ready? See how much salt that is. Okay, so my guess was about a quarter to a half a teaspoon. This is the whole teaspoon. Let's see what we got here. Okay, it's less than a whole teaspoon. Looks like half teaspoon is going to win. Looks like it's probably... There you go. So now, every time you see me sprinkle salt, it's about half a teaspoon. Salt all out. New salt. Half teaspoon of salt. Vegetables aren't, uh, could use some, I don't know, crisping up. So I'm just going to leave them on the bottom of the pan. I'm going to put chicken on top of vegetables. You can obviously take the vegetables out and put the chicken in if you want your stuff to stay separated. And just to make sure that um, we have a source of water to, so that nothing dries out. And um, make sure that our chicken flavor is good and strong. I'm going to throw in some chicken broth. So bone broth I'm going to put in two to start with. The carrots aren't cooking quite as fast as I had hoped, so I'm turning off the heat because my burners will stay hot for a long time. You want to turn it to low if you have a burner that doesn't, if you don't have a glass top. So these take deceptively long to cook. But once their little tips start turning up like this, I don't know that you can see that very well. I'm a little closer. Once their little tips start turning up like this and getting brown. They are oh so yummy.